So as an incoming freshman, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, coming to annual ring was, I had no idea what, was it, what it was about. I knew it was canoe races and coming up to their cabin. And I think that so far, you know, with the classes that I've taken, I feel like I'm going to be you know, put into a really good position job-wise um, for what I want to do. Forest Service law enforcement kind of sparked my eye just because like, I love the outdoors, being born and raised in Alaska, and I want a job that will keep me outdoors and not behind a desk. My whole life I grew up working outside, but when I was finishing up high school, I was thinking about what I wanted to do for a career. And I knew that I didn't want to be working inside all the time. I wanted to be able to work outside a little bit as well. Just something, something about forestry. It just seems like it'd be, it would be an exciting thing to get up every day and go out to the forest or you know, work with these products that came from the forest. Well, I'm a natural resource major, so I learn about also like the social aspects that come in with forestry, not just the uh, scientific aspects, and about atmospheric sciences, water sciences, so it's a little more comprehensive, I would say, and I learn about different things. The forest program is very extensive, and the choices in what I can study are broad, and I'm quite fortunate to be able to um, study from so I've done a course in maybe forest engineering as well as being able to study in wood science major and also forest resources. Well, having attended another school in forestry, I see that having this forest adjacent to the university is a huge advantage to this college. We get to come out here for field trips to watch operations. We get to come out here for classes and labs to do lab work, um, collect data and go back to the university and process that data. On top of that, there's also the fact that 90% of the literature in forestry is written by the professors who are currently teaching here or have taught at College of Forestry at OSU. The faculty that we have, they go the extra mile all the time to really make sure that you're learning what you should be learning. It's helped quite a bit with uh, networking with people outside of the school and in the industry. You get to build a lot of good relationships with people that uh, could be future employers. And then also the fact that it is such a small personal college that I've had the ability to meet people in my classes and um, have study groups with them and really just get to know the people around me. I think that's helped me a lot academically. The big picture of forestry is we're not just harvesting trees, it's also planting trees and raising trees. Protecting not just trees, but the environment and the animals that live in it. It's not just trees, it's streams, rivers, wildlife, everything in the forest. We're talking about creating wildlife habitat, maintaining wildlife habitat, uh, sequestering carbon, cleaning our air, and a place for and where our streams and water start and a place for the water to be filtered and cleaned out for the cities and drinking water of people. There's a lot more depth in the policies associated with forestry, the resource itself, how it can be used within the society and I think learning, I guess learning to find the sustainable balance or the, the best outcome for that resource in whatever area it is. I use the knowledge that I gain at OSCU and with my work here to kind of open up the forestry field to more people. I feel like I could go out there and reach out to more people to come out and use it as a resource for health and building community connections and it's a great resource for everybody to use.